Sure, the world loves a majestic waterfall or an ancient ruin. But have you ever craved something different? Something from the hidden corners of the globe? Ditch the crowds and embark on a journey to discover nature's lesser known marvels in this video. Picture towering not one, but three volcanic giants fused together. Kilimanjaro may steal the spotlight, but what about serenity instead of fiery peaks? Leave the postcards behind and dive into the heart of over 2,000 crystal clear lakes in Masurian Lakeland in Poland. Stay tuned for the last one because it no longer exists, and you will only be able to see it through the movies it was featured in. Before moving on to the video, please make sure to subscribe and hit that like button for more virtual explorations with us. Without any further ado, sit back, relax, and enjoy the scenery. Towering over Tanzania at a staggering 19,000 feet, Kilimanjaro isn't just Africa's highest peak, it's the world's tallest freestanding mountain, dwarfing its surroundings. Its name, a fascinating blend of Bantu and Kiswahili, translates to Mountain of Light, possibly referencing its snow-capped peak glittering under the African sun. Kilimanjaro isn't one mountain, but three volcanic giants fused together. Kibo, the dormant giant at the summit, Mwenzi, a weathered and eroded volcano, and Shira, the oldest and smallest cone. This volcanic trio lies within the Kilimanjaro National Park, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, east of Tanzania's bustling capital, Dar es Salaam. Beyond its majestic height and volcanic origins, Kilimanjaro holds several intriguing secrets. Its glaciers, remnants of a once mighty ice cap, are receding rapidly, highlighting the impact of climate change. The mountain is also home to a unique ecosystem with over 3,000 plant species and diverse animal life, including elephants, leopards, and the elusive black and white colobus monkeys. Batina, a tiny archipelago off Abu Dhabi, is a haven for marine life. Protected as a nature reserve, it boasts coral reefs, seagrass meadows, and mangroves teeming with diverse species. Despite the harsh environment, high salinity, and warm temperatures, Butina supports rare creatures like dugongs, hawksbill turtles, and dolphins. This unique island serves as a vital research hub for climate change and conservation efforts. Scientists study its resilient coral reefs and track endangered turtles using satellite tags. Butina's significance extends beyond the UAE, as research here sheds light on regional marine connections. Jeta Grotto, a marvel of nature, is a five and a half mile long cave system in Lebanon. It's famous for two sections, the lower cave, accessible by boat through an underground river, and the upper galleries, reached via a tunnel and walkways. Discovered in 1836 by Reverend William Thompson, an American missionary who ventured some 160 feet into the cave, the lower cave provided fresh water to over a million people. The upper galleries, boasting the world's largest stalactite, were unveiled later. Beyond its beauty, Jada holds historical significance. Ancient artifacts hint at human presence in prehistoric times. The caves even served as a military shelter during the Lebanese Civil War. Today, Yeda is a top tourist attraction, showcasing Lebanon's natural heritage. It's a symbol of resilience, having survived war and environmental challenges. Nestled in northeastern Poland, the Masurian Lakeland, also known as the Land of a Thousand Lakes, is a breathtaking set of over 2,000 shimmering lakes interconnected by canals and rivers. This freshwater wonderland is dotted with charming villages and embraced by verdant forests. The crown jewel of the lakeland is Sniardwi, the largest lake in Poland, sprawling over 44 square miles. Its crystal clear waters teem with fish, while its idyllic shores beckon kayakers and boaters to embark on tranquil journeys. Mamre, the second largest lake, is a labyrinth of interconnected bays and islands, perfect for exploring hidden coves and discovering secluded beaches. Beyond the allure of its lakes, the Masurian Lakeland boasts a rich history and cultural heritage. The region was once inhabited by the Masurians, 
an ethnic group known for their unique language and traditions. One of the most fascinating aspects of the Masurian Lakeland is its biodiversity. Lush forests teeming with wildlife, from soaring eagles to shy deer, surround the lakes, creating a haven for nature enthusiasts. Imagine a string of 1,192 emerald islands scattered across the turquoise waters of the Indian Ocean, each fringed by powdery white sand and kissed by gentle waves. Welcome to the Maldives, an archipelago nation unlike any other. The Maldives boasts the unique distinction of being the lowest-lying country on Earth, with its highest point barely scraping 7.5 feet above sea level. This equatorial paradise is a haven for sunseekers, with temperatures hovering around 30 degrees Celsius year-round. But the Maldives' true magic lies beneath the waves. Vibrant coral reefs teeming with colorful fish, majestic manta rays gliding through the crystal-clear waters, and playful dolphins escorting your boat. Additionally, luxury is redefined here. Imagine waking up to the sound of waves lapping against your private villa and stepping out onto your own stretch of pristine beach. Sadly, rising sea levels pose a real threat to this island nation. Experiencing the Maldives now is not just a luxurious escape, but a chance to witness and appreciate a truly unique yet disappearing paradise. Germany's Black Forest, aptly named Schwarzwald in German, isn't actually black but lush and verdant. Spanning over 2,000 square miles in southwest Germany, bordering France, it's a mountainous region famed for its dense evergreen forests, charming villages, and rich folklore. This fairy tale landscape boasts quaint towns like Triburg, renowned for its waterfalls, and Freiburg, famous for its Gothic cathedral and sunny plazas. But the Black Forest isn't just scenery. History echoes from ancient Roman baths and medieval castles like Hohenbaden, perched dramatically on a cliff. Over 60% of the region is covered in forest, providing habitat for diverse wildlife like deer, wild boars, and even the elusive black grouse. Beyond its natural beauty, the black forest is steeped in tradition. Cuckoo clocks, intricately carved and chiming on the hour, are iconic souvenirs. Approximately 2.6 million people call the black forest home, preserving its cultural heritage and welcoming visitors with warm hospitality. Azerbaijan, a country nestled between the Caspian Sea and the Caucasus Mountains, boasts a unique geological phenomenon, mud volcanoes. These fascinating spouts of mud and gas, found primarily in the Gabustan region, west of the capital Baku, dot the landscape, adding an otherworldly touch to the already diverse scenery. The mud volcanoes are formed by the presence of underground hydrocarbon deposits, mainly methane gas. As pressure builds up, the gas forces its way through mudstone, creating mud eruptions that can reach heights of several feet. The sight and sound of the mud bubbling and splattering, coupled with the pungent smell of sulfur, creates an otherworldly atmosphere. The mud volcanoes support unique ecosystems, with plant and animal species adapted to the harsh conditions. You might even spot mud volcano salamanders found only in this place. What's more, Azerbaijan is home to several burning mud volcanoes where the escaping gas ignites, creating flames that dance atop the mud eruptions. Uluru, also known as Ayers Rock, rises majestically from the heart of Australia's Red Centre, 273 miles southwest of Alice Springs. This sandstone monolith, with a base circumference of nearly 6 miles and 1,000 feet above the surrounding plain, is no mere rock. It's a deeply spiritual and significant landmark for the Anangu people who have inhabited the area for millennia. Estimated to be over 550 million years old, Uluru's history stretches back to the very formation of the continent. Aboriginal rock paintings depicting hunting scenes and creation myths adorn its caves. European discovery in 1873 marked a turning point, leading to its naming after Sir Henry Ayers and later sparking debate about access and ownership. 
In 1985, the Australian government formally handed ownership back to the Enangu, who now manage the Uluru Kata Chuda National Park in partnership with Parks Australia. Uluru's unique composition, weathering patterns, and astronomical significance set it apart. Composed of Arco sandstone, rich in iron oxide, it glows red at dawn and sunset, captivating onlookers with its ever-changing hues. Wind and water have sculpted its distinctive dome shape, while its alignment with the sun during solstices held immense importance for the Anangu calendar and ceremonies. Looming over the Bay of Naples, Mount Vesuvius is Europe's most notorious active volcano. Located just six miles east of Naples, Italy, its fiery history has shaped the region for millennia. A stratovolcano, formed by layers of lava, ash, and rock ejected during past eruptions, Vesuvius's origin lies where the African tectonic plate dives beneath the Eurasian plate. Vesuvius has erupted over 50 times in recorded history, with the most infamous being the eruption of 79 AD. This cataclysmic event buried the Roman cities of Pompeii and Herculaneum under ash and pumice, preserving them as eerie time capsules. Vesuvius, though potentially destructive, remains a captivating natural wonder. Its fiery past and potential future eruptions draw scientists, historians, and curious minds alike. Unfortunately, the Azure Window, perched on Dwedra Point, the westernmost tip of Gozo Island in Malta, no longer exists. It was a stunning natural arch formation near the village of San Lawrence. Formed over millennia by the relentless pounding of waves on the limestone cliffs, the Azure Window became a natural arch around the 19th century. Its dramatic beauty graced the silver screen in several productions, including the 1993 film By the Sword and the HBO series Game of Thrones, where it served as the backdrop for Daenerys Targaryen's wedding ceremony. Sadly, on March 8, 2017, during a fierce storm, the 91-feet-tall arch succumbed to the power of the sea, leaving behind only a jagged stack of rocks. This sudden loss served as a stark reminder of the vulnerability of natural wonders against nature's forces. Even though the arch itself is gone, the site where it once stood remains a popular tourist destination. Visitors can now walk along the shore, explore the rock stacks, and imagine the majestic presence of the Azure Window through historical photos and videos. The Azure Window of Malta concludes our journey through the magic that awaits when you dare venture beyond the familiar. Remember, the most breathtaking sights aren't always the most famous. Sometimes, the greatest adventures are found in the quiet corners of the world, waiting to be discovered by those who dare to look beyond the expected. If you enjoyed this video and are still looking for more stunning scenery, be sure to check out our videos about South Africa and the most surreal UNESCO World Heritage Sites. Make sure to subscribe for more journeys. Until our paths cross again on the next video, stay safe.